After joining the European Union in 2004, Hungary capitalized on its cost-competitive labor force and functioning connections with the rest of Europe to become a major recipient of foreign direct investment. The stock of FDI that the country has accumulated in the past decade has now become a major springboard for the development of local innovation functions, with global manufacturers strengthening R&D activity around their Hungarian production facilities. One of them is General Electric, which runs 11 factories, four research and development centers and two business services centers in Hungary, and launched its only European digital hub in Budapest in late 2016 to support the digitalization of its operations. Historically, uh, Hungary has probably punched above its weight in terms of engineering, uh, technology, so a number of very important inventions come from Hungary. The Carburetta, uh, the Model T Ford was designed by a Hungarian, the Volkswagen Beetle, uh, Janos van Neumann is basically the father of digital computing, uh, Microsoft Excel, Microsoft Word, all these things were invented by Hungarians. What we've seen is that tradition of mathematical uh, physicists, chemistry, that kind of analytical tradition is alive and well in the 21st century. Probably more importantly, Hungary has kept a lot of its industrial heritage. Within about half an hour from this digital hub here in Budapest, we have three large factories, which we can go and test our technology on. The strategy of delivering and developing the industrial internet for GE from Hungary is just a perfect mix between the industrial heritage and the digital talent and skills force that we have available today. The automotive industry has been particularly keen on turning Hungary into one of its main production hubs in Europe. German car producer Audi stood out among the first Western investors in the country. The group opened an engine plant in the town of Dior in 1994, and that facility has now grown into the largest engine factory in the world, rolling out about 2 million engines per year, and now also assembling various Audi models like the iconic TT. Audi's Dior factory is now gearing up to start the serial production of electric engines and thus spearhead the group's transition towards electric mobility. Audi will launch his first electric car next year. We are very proud that uh, our plant will build for this electric car the main part of the electric power chain. We will build a new production hall for the electric engines and actually uh, we install the production equipment in this new hall. We have all the employees, all the experts for uh, this new type of engine. It's a big challenge for us to start the production next year.